It's time to get rosy, girl. Today, I'm going to be sharing with y'all my favorite rose-scented fragrances. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited because y'all know I love rose. First of all, see the background? It's different colors, like different color pinks, okay? Not different colors. But anyway, love the rose-scented fragrances. I have so many rose fragrances to show y'all. But before I do, make sure you like the video because it helps me out tremendously. And also, it lets me know that you really love my content and I can make more content like this one. Also, make sure you comment down below what is your favorite rose fragrances right now. Girl, drop them down below in the comment section. And also, don't forget to subscribe because one is free and two, you don't want to miss a video from me. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So when I first started my perfume collection, I kind of strayed away from rose. And I don't know why because now I absolutely love rose. You smell rose in a fragrance, you do not have to have a straight rosy scent. Fragrances definitely goes through different stages as you wear them. One minute you might smell rose, the next minute you might smell peony, then you might smell vanilla, then you might smell taco bean. So fragrances definitely go through different stages as you wear them. So just because a fragrance has a rose note in it does not mean you're going to smell rose from start to finish, depending on the fragrance. We're going to start off with my favorite rose fragrance this one is one affordable it is so affordable and two this fragrance smells really good I did a review on this fragrance the comment section was lit with girl that smells so good people sleeping on this fragrance it's so good it's so good y'all this fragrance is no other than paris hilson rose rush this is so affordable y'all it's like 12.99 i always get mine at burlington because they always have the one ounce for 12.99 and i'm thinking about getting my nieces i think i'm going to get both of them this fragrance for christmas because one the bottle by itself y'all is just stunning and the scent is really really nice it's a nice feminine rosy scent absolutely love the bottle do y'all see that this is giving i need to do a tiktok on like my favorite perfume bottles yeah i need i need to do that asap because this one would win the prize y'all i love this one and it's really really affordable this definitely is just on point the rose in this does not smell like a synthetic or cheap rose this definitely does not smell like a cheap rose this smells like a nice fresh pink rose this has may rose in it and it's not too strong it's not too light either it's the perfect amount of rose now this fragrance you will smell the rose from the beginning to the end and honestly y'all it smells so good from start to finish you are going to love this fragrance if you want to get into rose and you don't know where to start start with paris hilson rose rush if i had this when i was first starting my collection y'all i don't think this fragrance is out well no it wasn't out i would have fallen in love with the rose way sooner if this fragrance was out y'all i love this fragrance and if you want to creep into rose i think this is a good fragrance to start with because rose is not for everyone but y'all i'm telling you even if you don't like rose because a lot of people um under my review video was saying that they did not like rose but they love this scent this rose is a special rose the only downfall about this fragrance i will be honest this does not last on the skin that long i will say about four to five hours if you spray heavy but other than that girl this smells so good i wore this in the springtime to brunch and y'all this smells so so good and i got so many compliments so check out rose rush next fragrance i have is from victoria's secret and i'm not sure if this is discontinued or not and that's really why i don't like victoria's secret and bath and body works because they always discontinue stuff and then it's like i'm telling you but you can't get it and i don't i don't like to do that but I'm gonna go ahead and um show this fragrance this is patchouli rose and this was on a semi-annual sale so i'm pretty sure they don't sell it anymore but girl if you have it in your collection pick it up and sniff it you're gonna be like oh my god so good i'm about right here this smells so good this is a nice peachy rosy scent so you do get some fruitiness in that fragrance from the peach 
the rose in this is more so of a sweet rose mixed with the peach the sweetness of the peach are you feeling the vibes like this this smells so good it does not last long at all i do like wearing this to bed like straight out the shower going to bed absolutely love this fragrance and also i used to wear this to the gym because i just love like the peachy rosiness of this it smells so good so if you have this in your collection y'all don't sleep on this and you can also mix this with the um paris hilton rose rush and you can mix this with a lot of other fragrances if you want that peachy rosy scent this is patchouli rose you do get a little bit of patchouli but you don't get that much you really smell the um peach and the rose this smells so so good next fragrance i have is rouge Bariana. oh my gosh the rose in this smells so good but on my skin the rose does not come out until the middle stages of the fragrance um on my body but i know some people that say they smell the rose from beginning to end but on me the middle stages is about when i get the most rose this smells so good y'all this smells so good it is a lot of muskiness in this fragrance really musky really woody floral love this fragrance it's a very unique fragrance though everybody is not going to like this fragrance and i am going to say that um it is an acquired taste y'all it is if you like unique fragrances and if you want to get into unique fragrances i would suggest everybody start off with rouge by rihanna it smells really good now the rose in this is not like a sweet rose in my opinion the rose kind of mixed with the suede and y'all i don't know what it is it mixes so well with this fragrance this fragrance has suede in it and it smells so good y'all the suede in this it's not like a masculine suede. It smells so good. Trust me. It's kind of hard to explain this fragrance because it is unique. Um, so you can kind of classify it as a lot of things. But y'all, it smells so good. So if you want to try this out, I definitely suggest trying it out. And I will link all of the fragrances that I'm talking about down below in the description box. Next fragrance I have, y'all already know, I went crazy over this perfume house. And people are still watching my um, $10 perfume house video. I don't, girl, I don't even know what it was called. But this is from Jean Marc Paris Flair Paris Rose. Y'all already know I love his fragrances. I do not see his fragrances as much in TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and Burlington. I'm assuming everybody's buying it up. But this rose scent is really, really good. This is a nice child let me spray this one because i love this one this is a nice champagne -y rose if you can find this y'all i definitely suggest getting your hands on it and this is actually my best friend's favorite fragrance she always wears this fragrance i sent her um i believe one yeah i sent her one of these for christmas and y'all she she loves it. it smells so beautiful it's a beautiful rose but it also has like that um champagne -y feel to it love it i love the champagne mixed with the rose jean mark paris has some great fragrances do not sleep when you see his fragrances in tj maxx marshalls and stuff don't think oh it's ten dollars it's twelve dollars it's fourteen dollars at least pick it up try it out if you don't like it you can return it but girl i'm telling you if you get this one the flair paris rose you're not gonna return this you're gonna fall in love and you probably are going to clear out the shelf this one smells so good i absolutely love it i do have a small dent in this but honestly y'all already know i have so many fragrances it's just ridiculous at this point but this is a nice rose scent a rosy champagne -y, bubbly type of scent girl get your hands on it so the next thing i have some people really love it some people really hate it in my opinion i absolutely love this fragrance love it this is rosa botanica by balenciaga everybody loves the flora botanica i tried it did not like it i sold it will not purchase it again i do not like it i don't know what it is it was giving me nothing and people were saying like it lasts so long on their skin i couldn't even smell it after like 30 40 minutes so i don't know maybe it's me 
but I do not like Flora Botanica. It's just not me. This Rose Botanica, first of all, look at the bottle. This is the prettiest perfume bottle in my collection. I absolutely love this fragrance bottle. It is so cute. It is so, oh my gosh, so different. And y'all know I love unique fragrances. I love unique perfume bottles. I am all for it. Y'all, look at this. Oh my gosh, I love this perfume bottle. Now, I love this fragrance. Everybody is not. This is heavy on the rose, okay? And this is heavy on the red rose, not the um pink rose. Pink rose, to me, is a little bit more softer. And this one actually could have different types of roses in it, but this is heavy on the red rose. Red rose. Red rose is like pungent. It's, it's like coming for you, okay? Um, I do have a little dent in this. And I don't know why y'all, when I have luxury fragrances and I'm getting out of this mindset, I do not like wearing my luxury fragrances unless I'm going somewhere like fancy or something. Y'all, I'm cutting that out. This year, I cut that out. Like I am starting to wear my luxury fragrances to the grocery store, running errands in the house. I don't care if I wanna put it on, I'm gonna put it on because I would have a big bottle like this and girl, I would have it for years and not, not use it. And I love this fragrance. So yeah, I'm starting to use her even more. I do also like wearing her to bed. I love this perfume. So I really like botanical fragrances. I love botanical fragrance notes, love it. So this is straight rose and botanical mixed together that's what this is so if you do not like botanical um fragrances you're not gonna like this you're not gonna like it this is very earthy um greeny if you don't like that you're not gonna like this me i absolutely love botanical fragrance notes and fragrances i love it um i love a nice leafy note you get that mixed with the rose so it's to me it just smells so good if you have this fragrance let please let me know what you think about it or if you have tried this fragrance please let me know what you think about it down below in the comment section for me this is a love and a lot of people don't i don't want to say a lot of people it's 50 50 like my shirt it's 50 50 okay some people really like it some people really hate it it goes both ways but a lot of people really like flora botanica it's just not my thing rose botanica in my opinion is 10 times better love the rose note it is very strong on the rose i will say if you are a beginner when it comes to rose i wouldn't get this if you kind of heavy in the game you probably would like it the next fragrance i have y'all is one of my new babies i just got this fragrance and i'm in love with this fragrance oh my gosh it smells so so good and y'all i got the little one ounce it looks so small and cute this is ysl mon perry intense mint so it's just the intense version of mon perry y'all look at this bottle it is so cute it's so small y'all i'm trying to get into the one ounces um because i have so many fragrances but y'all it is so cute it is so freaking cute i love the bottle the bottle y'all the scent is oh my gosh this is strong i like this i love a strong fragrance this is strong it lasted on my skin all day i wore this twice and i'm trying to pump my brakes because girl i just got it and i got a little one ounce and i don't know why maybe it's just me maybe i'll do the same thing but when i get a one ounce fragrance i feel like i use the one ounce I always want to use the one ounce more than the other bottles or like my big big bottles my 3.4 flu ounce bottles I be trying to like hurry up and use this I don't know why but this one smells so good the rose note in this this is sweet sexy rosy y'all this smells so good musky this also has peony in it and y'all know my favorite flower besides rose is peony i love peonies and i love rose honestly y'all they kind of go hand in hand with me i love both of them i think both of them are just beautiful flowers and i'm a flower girl y'all i love flowers like buy me flowers buy me flowers like buy me flowers why not buy me flowers this smells so good it smells so good. I love this fragrance. 
everybody's calling me everybody's calling me so the rose in this is definitely there but you also do get like some fruity notes of like black currant some raspberry also you get some muskiness to it i love it and also you get the peony and i feel like peony and rose really do work together really good so y'all if you want like a fruity florally rosy scent i definitely would suggest this one and if you like fruity scents but you want to get into rose too i think this is a great combination fragrance i really do love the fruitiness of it and the rosiness of it the kind of florals mm, just chef's kiss i love it and the bottle is really really cute i love this is this purple or pink um i believe this is pink it kind of looks like purple on screen but this is pink it's like dark pink and then it kind of ombres out y'all love this fragrance so that's this one for so the next fragrance i have y'all is so good it is look at i'm already showing it y'all it is so good can y'all guess what fragrance this is y'all already know this fragrance is my jam love this fragrance will always repurchase this fragrance y'all this is shagaf oud swiss what this is swiss arabian shagaf oud y'all it's time for me to go to sleep okay y'all see i got a little bun for y'all but anyway this fragrance is shagaf oud by swiss arabian y'all already know this fragrance is just top tier okay top tier top tier top tier it is like 42 dollars on amazon this smells so good if you want to get into oud please pick this up this is a nice oudy rosy praline oh my gosh praline is so the praline mixed with the rose is so good in this now i will say in this fragrance i smell the rose from the beginning to the end but some people say that they can smell like the rose halfway or to like the end of the fragrance and y'all i watch so many fragrance reviews you you don't even know girl i i be up on game okay this fragrance smells so good the praline mixed with the rose so good the oud so good this fragrance will last all day and it will project all day you can wear this fragrance for 24 hours and i'm telling you people are going to still smell you people are going to be like what do you have on 24 hours later y'all this smells so good it's so potent it's so strong you do not want to go in with four or five sprays y'all one to two is enough this is so potent it's really good love the rose love the deep rose in this it smells so good mixed with the praline this is a very sweet rosy scent the praline note is very strong in this fragrance but it does not overpower the rose if you don't have this girl go on amazon and, and get it within two days this smells so good and i'm not sure if this is going to be on sale for black friday but i know last black friday this was on sale and this is a fan favorite everybody loves it so that is it for my favorite rose fragrances i hope y'all really enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give this video a big thumbs up it helps me out tremendously also let me know down below in the comment section what is your favorite rose fragrance and also don't forget to subscribe because one is free and two you don't want to miss a video from me thank you so much for tuning into pink fluff empire and i will see you on my next video